This would be a starting point for any project and uh, it means that we are providing this an out-of-the-box solution and we are going to look into the few application area like sales dashboard starts with sales and inventory and receivables we are looking into the swinging monthly sales that are shown as a moving average of 3 L 12 month we're looking into the share of item sales and uh, free tax invoices some averages our delivery performance are we late or on time when we are comparing we are comparing against year to day year on year or against budgets analysis of new businesses new customer returning customer lost customer or items profit or gp should be equal as well as all other measure as they are in fno to ascend inventory information and part of the receivables now as this is an overview it means that uh, the details are in other reports and we are going to look into this so in every case we are looking into the same data the same process we are just looking into from a different perspective where we are bringing some um, item table as customer table we could be also focused more into item and we bring the hierarchy that we want to uh, analyze now what is your best customer you will choose by not one but several kpis in sales we have 300 kpis to choose from so that you can see what uh, is good which is green so it's like great uh, sales uh, great year-to-day growth in absolute or in relative terms or what is bad a lot of overdue increase in receivable balance or not a lot of action or a lot of invoices is happening here now another view is a view by date because without any doubt this is the most important dimension we provide 50 attributes in date dimension and you may see that apart from the transaction values we have also the reporting currency we call this additional currency where in this case uh, there is a corporate currency selected that is uh, different in exchange rate as one on one as you can see here and only with these reporting services we provide about 300 kpis in the reporting currency itself here it is also understood that in any time we can filter the tables with Power BI with attributes from another table here. Now um, let's see some of the details when we are looking into the delivery we are looking into the days late and amount late if a document or a line has been late and that's based on the promised planned expected delivery date then we are logging into the days late and we can analyze amount late here and this part is of course available also in the purchasing part where we are looking into whether our vendors are delivering us goods or services on time or they are late so this is a great for delivery performance analysis we may be into the new business analysis where we are looking into how many new items or new customers have been sold and this is a list for a quarter in 2018 these are all demo data and uh, which by the way you can analyze just after this session you can see i'm logging in here as demo at bfo dynamics and we do provide you with absolutely the same experience with the same login as i'm doing uh, this presentation right now so this is a user that you connect to the power bi service and this is the login power bi we allow with zero to get absolutely the same experience as uh, I did. Um, now uh, we can look into the sales transactions if the customer are changing assortment or any other view. Let's just go th through other areas really quick. So we can see in the finance we can provide information about the financial statement in a visual uh, tabular or graphical way we support up to 15 financial dimensions in FNO and what is also very important for corporates we have seen the additional currency or reporting currency as well as date uh, hierarchies as a normal calendar or fiscal date calendar and this fiscal date calendar also supports the fiscal based time intelligence what means that calendar date starts in January the fiscal date starts in July 
and we do provide a year-to-day measure as you can see here this is a need change or sales it doesn't matter year-to-day fiscal and this is uh, year-to-day variance which is based on the calendar it's 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 good because you can see that the performance can be wildly different if there is a exchange rate now in most cases uh, the KPIs that we have in BF for Dynamics do not require any explanation, are easy to be consumed, and also the navigation through the reports is simple. So if we see here, this is receivable aging by aging buckets over the two years that we selected. And if you want to see why is this value here a negative one, every table here is being filtered. We look into the customer value you can see this is a customer whose balance in this time was minus 33 and we can go to the document level which was an open document should or probably not be open it should be applied to an invoice if that was open at that time or for example top bottom approach if we are looking into the aging buckets and we can just ask who is owing us money more than two years we can see this customer and with one more click we have the documents that were that are open at that time for more than two year time now inventory i would just highlight one feature that is uh, balance inventory balance by aging group so we have a buckets of aging for, it means items not moving less than 100 days 100 days to a year or more than a year and the report would look like this so you can see the inventory value goes down which makes us happy turnover is faster which is great however if we're looking into the total value by aging buckets we can see that we are successfully decreasing already fast moving items but definitely not successfully items which are not moving already by default and furthermore we can look into like this where we would say do we have a problem or not so what we have is the aging buckets for an item where uh, aging buckets are here a few items three items are under 100 days which is fine 99 items are not moving 100 days or uh, to a year and 11 more than a year and if you look into the aging stock value and compare this value to the last purchase price then we can see that this bucket here has almost doubled the price as if we would buy this item now and this is the average purchase price in the period which actually confirms this we have also a good feeling to have a feeling how big of an impact this will be from our balance sheet into the profit and loss we can see what is the frequency of purchasing selling last purchase quantity and other information just in one simple table further we just have a blend into the manufacturing we are looking into we have done probably between 50 and 100 manufacturing projects where we can look at everything that has been consumed by cost groups uh, to everything that we have uh, consumed produced uh, and we look into selecting procurement category let's say lady gaga jeans this is a manufacturer of textile we can see the quantities average cost how good our plans or bill of materials are and what we have consumed so we can at any now time we know what was the produced cost what we have produced what is the uh, what are the trends and uh, how are the capacities we can go to the equipment efficiency uh, and everything uh, that is in the manufacturing really a lot and another area that just have a glimpse about this is retail we have done probably more than 100 retails so here we are looking into the retail specifics retail is everything you have seen in sales plus the retail specific like basket value receives uh, sale distribution by time uh, voided transactions a lot of operational statistics we look into the basket value how this is done by the quarter by the hour by the store we have to different types of the stores to, to analyze by on um, time to a quarter and for example payment habits of your customer cash versus cards and on and on it goes 
So all this comes as an out-of-the-box solution on day one from BFO Dynamics and our approach is that we don't say we have done 1000 projects and we can deliver whatever we want. We can say, okay, this is experience from 1000 projects. We will install it, we will you will consume it for a while in the POC, but then you just tell us if there is something missing, what is missing. So that's the focus on our project.